Good morning, friends. It's May 4th, and I thought I would show you what I was up to today, since I haven't made a video in a while. I'm doing a little bit of prep work, so I have some food in the refrigerator, but let me show you. On Facebook, I saw these, and all you do is you take uh, their cheese pickles. All you do is take a pan, which I'm getting ready to put eggs in this too, so the uh, oil that came from the cheese will be really good for the eggs. Anyways, all you do is you put some cheese on the bottom, and then you add a pickle. Can you see the pickle there? Yeah, that's a pickle. And you dry off the pickle, and I'm kind of letting the fat absorb this, but should be really good and they're crunchy too there's one that the edge came off and I taste them you don't add anything to them you put a little cheese on top you cook it at 400 for about 15 17 minutes and they're delicious and then like I said with the pan there I'm going to make some egg and vegetable cups so I've got six eggs and the other day I put all my fresh vegetables in baggies in the freezer after preparing them and cutting them up. So when I go to add them to a soup or take them out, uh, I did all of it, even the spinach and the little carrots. And so I'm going to heat them up right now and then I'll add them to the eggs. And I'm also going to add some cottage cheese and a little... Uh, almond milk just to kind of thin it out so that will be my egg cups and then I get these meatballs you can get them at anywhere but I usually get them at either Aldi's or Costco and these are Costco and all I do is I put them I know it's dirty but I spray with this spray I get at Aldi's I just spray the bottom I put the frozen meatballs on it I put the meatballs in and then I do I put another spray over the top of the meatballs and they get nice and brown so this is not burnt I know it looks it but it was on the bottom but anyway it's really really good so those are still warm and I thought I'd show you my I've got some chicken out to unthaw for my hubby because he likes chunks of meat which I really don't but anyways these are got four bags of the carrots and I love to make vegetable chili with beans and this is cabbage I just took you know the pre pre uh, fit mix cabbage mix and then these were the peppers I've got some peppers I took my fresh tomatoes and cut them up. And of course, the juice kind of came to the bottom, but that's okay because that goes in my soup or my chili. And then this is the best idea I have ever had uh, or followed. You just put, you open up your bag of spinach and you just put it in here kind of showing an odd color and it's not it's all very green see anyways when you go to add it you just break it apart I'll go ahead and put some more in my soup so you have a handful of the spinach and when you crumble it it just look at that which is great for soups or eggs or anything and that will be I've been doing this for a little while now that'll be the last time you will ever have um, spinach that goes bad so let me try to seal this up with one hand it's a beautiful day out by the way and there's my candle always followed me I thought I was gonna leave the room Okay, and you can, I've got, uh, 
these are those uh, Persian cucumbers and they taste just like zucchini in a soup or anything so you just take out what you want and they're ready and I also have celery and radishes cut up here's my radishes and radishes give just a little bit of hint of spice but other than that once you cook them in a soup or anything they taste like uh, almost like a potato so I had a couple bags of that so I hope that's some ideas for you and I'm gonna get back to this and I hope you're having a beautiful Saturday day I sure am let me show you how this I'll show you out the front door absolutely gorgeous day skies are blue oh that's my ivy English ivy it always grows right there my husband just keeps it uh, trimmed back and just makes a nice coverage for the walk there you go and it doesn't take over if you just keep it up a couple times a year uh, he just trims it and it works great so See you guys later.